cannot wait to see all of your prop plays because everybody loves, you know, your strikeout props, but prop plays are the best. I love NFL betting on some props, but let's get to today's slate because I think there are a lot of people who are probably looking at this slate and wondering how to attack it because there's so many huge money line favorites today. So maybe strikeout props are the way to go. So let's go down the list of the menu. Let's start with the Nats and the Phillies game. Ariel, I think there's a play you like here. I really like the Washington Nationals right-hander, Paolo Espino, over three and a half strikeouts. I'm seeing it at plus 110. Now, Espino is going up against the Phillies of the ninth highest K rate against right-handed pitchers. Those righty starters are averaging five strikeouts a start when up against the Phillies. Espino, since June 12th, he has gone over this number in four of six games when he's faced a team with a top 15 K rate against right-handers. I like the over three and a half strikeouts, Paolo Espino, today. Okay, Ariel, we were just talking about the Mets and Braves game a few minutes ago, and I like a first five under, but you are on a strikeout prop featuring Cookie Carrasco. This could work in both our favor strengths because this should be a good pitching matchup. The Braves are trying to catch the Mets. I like the Mets right-hander, Carlos Carrasco, over five and a half strikeouts. The Atlanta Braves have the second highest carry against right-handed pitchers, averaging just about five and a half strikeouts to start those righty starters. Carrasco has actually gone over five and a half strikeouts in six of the seven games where he's faced a team with a top 15 carry rate against right-handers. This number just seems a little low for me. I'm going with the over five and a half strikeouts for Cookie Carrasco. All right, let's go to the Twins and the Blue Jays. And listen, Ariel, I have placed money on Alec Manoa and his strikeout prop before, and I've been very disappointed. So you're going to have to sell me a little bit on Alec Manoa today. <laughs> same page as you Chelsea every time that I see Alec Manoa starting for Toronto I get this pit in my stomach all I want to do is bet the over a lot of the times it hasn't worked out yet this one with Minnesota as the 15th highest carry team against righties I thought okay there's a chance here I looked at the teams that rank between 10th and 20th in carry against right-handers that teams that Manoa has faced like Boston Oakland Milwaukee Baltimore Manoa's gone over five and a half strikeouts in six of the seven games against teams that are those middle of the pack teams. This one's a little tough because Minnesota is not as consistent being in that 15 ranked carry. However, because Manoa has gone over this against those kinds of teams, I'm going to say over five and a half strikeouts. There's a reason the overs choose more than the under here. Ooh, I hope we both come home on that because I like the Jays on the money line. We're talking to Ariel Epstein, sports betting analyst for Yahoo Sports. Make sure you catch her today on MLB Network's pregame spread. That is weekdays at 5 o'clock in the East with Matt Vaskersian. Okay, on the flip side of that game, Ariel, you like Sonny Gray to go under his K-prop, correct? This may be my favorite strikeout prop of the day. Minnesota's right-hander Sonny Gray under four and a half strikeouts. Toronto has the ninth lowest K rate against right-handed pitchers. Gray's gone under this number in seven of the nine games where he's faced one of those bottom 15 K rate teams. Four and a half is just a number that, um, I mean, the last time that he went over it, he did just do it against San Diego. He had five. However, the other time before that was his fourth start of the year against Cleveland. He had eight. Otherwise, every other start this year when he's up against the low K rate team, Gray goes under four and a half strikeouts. With Toronto, I'm going to say Gray, under four and a half strikeouts. 